for the exhaust system, I'm gonna use three KRM 8090 exhaust pipes. That's a very cheap option. Just kidding, it's the most expensive one. I choose the color brown because I think it's gonna fit the vibe of the bike with the different colors the best. My friend made me a few billet tubes. I'm gonna cut them in a 10 degree angle to make individual sections so I can uh, make the exhaust make a curve because I don't want to cut the KRM in half and weld it together because I think it would not look nearly as good as the original welds. The sections are gonna weld onto here and so I can uh, make the exhaust fit my setup. I am now finished with the exhaust flange on every cylinder. It turned out like this. Making those adapters was the first part of building the exhaust. The next part is putting them on and put also the exhaust system on with the springs. And the next part is building the exhaust bracket that the exhaust is also supported in a different position than on the springs. And the last part is building the connection to the uh, rear mufflers.
So this is now how it looks. I think it just looks absolutely crazy. I have to uh, I have to cut away the mount on this this side because I don't have any space here because of the engine mount. Also, I have minimal clearance between the exhaust and the pedals. Also on the other side. It barely passes, but it's all right. The next thing, I have to make a bracket for the exhaust mount, because on this flange, the mount itself, it's too less, it's too weak. I had the idea to make one single piece, and then I can mount every, uh, every exhaust on it. I removed this bracket and turned it around, so it faces in this direction. I also did this here. And this so that both sides are facing in this direction and I can make a nice mount. When I made the swing arm I made a thread under here where I can mount the exhaust bracket. Here is the exhaust bracket. It turned out very beautiful. My colleague made it yesterday. And I made the hose a little bigger so I can uh, move the exhaust and uh, mount it right there where I want to. This is what it looks like when it's mounted. The second cylinder exhaust fits very well. And the third I also have to make a little spacer here. The first pipe I'm going to build is for the second cylinder. The muffler sits, when it's finished, about here. 